Hey guys, so today I got another quick tip. Um, this has to do with bread, uh, because obviously you're doing keto or any sort of low carb diet, you, uh, you kinda can't have bread. So I've got something pretty impressive here. This is, I just recently found this. This is Dimpfelmeyer. You can find it here in Ontario. Uh, if you go to their website, you can find out where they actually, which stores actually carry this. Uh, but this is called the Power Slice. And uh, the macros on this are four grams of carbohydrates per slice, and it's uh, three grams of fiber and zero sugars. And there's 15 grams of protein for every slice. Um, so if you like having bread still, this is a good option for you. Um, now, it's a win-win situation because that loaf of bread right there, as you can see, it's, it's not very big. I mean, growing up, we probably bought loaves of bread, Wonder Bread's like this big. Um, this is $10. So the woman situation is either one, you will eat this and then you'll just kind of slowly stop craving and wanting bread and you just won't eat bread anymore. Or two, you'll eat so much of this, you'll go broke and you won't be able to afford bread, let alone anything else anyways. And uh, you know, you'll be good. So here's my little tip with this. If you, uh, if you like having bread. Now I don't like using toasters because I just find it dries bread out. So I have a different method for doing it. I know it's a bit more time consuming, uh, but I find it gets you a better quality cook on your bread. Um, so I cook it on the stovetop and I will cook it here on a, on a pan. I got it nice and hot right now. So obviously, um, you know, if, if you're gonna cook bread on the, on the stove, a lot of people you do naturally you'd use butter, but this is the magic when it comes to keto and actually just, flavors in general. So what I like to do is this little trick I learned about a year or two ago is that instead of butter, use some mayonnaise. And this is going to put the most beautiful golden sear. You don't need, don't need a lot. And then uh, put a little bit, bit of mayo on here. Nice hot pan, just get a little, so you just get a little spin around the pan. And that's gonna give it a nice, really golden crust and it's gonna be delicious. Um, again, you can, you can use butter if you want, but the thing I find with the mayonnaise is because there's some egg and stuff in it, it just kind of gives an extra sort of like caramelization on the bread. Uh, you can use butter if you want, but, uh, you know, I, I find that the using some mayonnaise definitely just lifts it up a little bit just because we're eating healthy and smart doesn't mean we can't eat delicious food at the same time. So this is almost done. Almost there. Yeah, see here, we get a little toss. See, it's got that nice sort of golden, golden edge to it there. Um, that's going to be delicious. Now you may be wondering, uh, did I put mayo on the other side? No, actually I didn't. Um, I don't tend to put mayo on both sides. Uh, just like you don't tend to butter both sides of toast. I don't know, it's just kind of a weird thing. Um, I mean, if you really wanted to, I have done it sometimes in the past, like when I'm making like a really nice sandwich or something, um, I will mayo both sides and give it a nice sort of crust. But you know, if it's just for like breakfast or something, I, I usually just will just do one side because you know, that's what normal people do. All right, so you'll see there's a, you know, it's a little brown on this side, but then on the, uh, the initial side of the mayo, it's got some nice golden color to it. And this is going to be wonderful. Still hot. It's so hot, but it's good. Anyways, that's it for uh, for this little just fit tip. Again, it's uh, Dumpelmeyer uh, power slice bread. Remember, it is it's eight ninety nine is what I found it at Sobeys. Uh, just check the Dumpelmeyer website for it, and um, like I said, you put in your postal code. It'll show you actually which store this particular this particular type of bread is being sold because they have. Dimpfmeyer has a bunch of different types of breads, but they'll show you which store this is being sold at, and uh, hopefully there's one near you and you can try it out. Oh, yeah, like and subscribe, and, and hit the little bell thing too, because that's how you get notified. It's, it's really stupid. You can subscribe to something, but you won't get notified unless you press the bell. Then, the, then you'll get notified when I upload a new video. And I'm making the content more often now, so you definitely want to keep updated on the notifications. All right, take care.